Paralyzed in the humble Broncos bus crash, one player, Ryan Stratznitsky, seeking spinal surgery in Thailand with hopes it could help restore some of his movement and control. We talked with Straz's mom about how it all went. The doctor was very, very um, pleased with how well it went and um, his uh, Ryan's um, adjustment to it. And um, they're very cautiously optimistic about about uh, improving his core functions and uh, being able to, you know, have a little bit more control. Straz arrived in Thailand on November 3rd, and Michelle says he was a bit nervous before the surgery, that he just wanted to get it over and done with. An epidural stimulator was implanted in his spine. A small device like a remote control will send electrical currents to his spinal cord to try to stimulate nerves and move limbs. Stratznitsky is scheduled to return to Canada in early December, but before that, plenty of rehab work ahead. After a few days, they'll start with uh, what's called mapping. So the stimulator will um, sort of be trained to answer his brain kind of messages and try and trigger the, um, the muscles and the nerves in his legs and, and all the way down his body, obviously. And um, then th that'll be pretty intensive, I think, at the seven hours a day for the five days a week. And then next week, he's having stem cell injections, I guess. Uh, which is actually kind of funny because that's the part he's most nervous about. Uh, he's just not a needle guy. Straz has also brought his sledge hockey sled and is hoping to hit the ice in Thailand before he comes home.